What is up, you beautiful noodles? Uh, welcome to Vlogmas Day 5. First of all, uh, just want to point this out before you say anything. Ignore this. The nails are sitting on my desk. They popped off. Uh, probably because who knows? They just popped off. Um, we're going to be crocheting. And today's Vlogmas is just going to be a cute little rant video uh, about me and my struggles of life. So... This wasn't going to be the original video. I had a super cute video. Um, I went to a concert, had footages, and I was going to show that, you know, talk about cute, quirky, I was running late, blah, blah, blah. And uh, right before I started actually editing the video, you know, procrastinating as one does when there's something that has to be done but they just want to kind of put it off I um start just you know Instagram is the place that people post their wins and I get that that's what it's for most of the time and most people's authentic them is you know their their wins and uh how good things went because previously they posted like how things didn't work whatever whatever this isn't like a, oh, you know, like, don't post all the good things that happen to you because it makes me feel bad about myself. No, um, that's up to me and my mental capacity. So going through and I just, I got frustrated. Oh, shoot. I messed that up. I got frustrated. And the frustration was more along the lines of I started to compare myself to other people on the Instagrams that were doing things in spaces that I eventually want to be in, doing things that I eventually want to do. And I tend to do this, I'm not sure if you guys do this, but I tend to uh, just basically in the midst of comparing myself to them, it's like, well, there's no need for me to do this anymore because somebody's already in that space doing that thing. And I get into this cycle where it's like my contribution to this space or doing this thing doesn't matter because there's already someone doing identical to what I want to do. Um, and that happens in a lot of spaces where I want to be, um, since I'm on YouTube right now, like YouTube, it happens to me here on YouTube. Um, you know, I, I start watching videos where it's like, oh, the influencer bubble is bursting. Not saying that my entire goal on YouTube is to be an influencer. I genuinely love this. Like, I get excited when it's time for me to do a video and I have no idea why I feel like I'm about to cry. But, you know, if it happens, let's just roll with it. Um, I get genuinely excited, you know, when it's time to do a video. I love planning the videos out. Um, I think the frustration comes when... And again, this is just me comparing myself to other people. I start seeing other content creators and it's like, wow, you, you know, you, you did the, what I would deem the bare minimum. Like this video is 100% the bare minimum, but it's me trying to get out my frustrations. Oh my God, I just want this to thank you. Um, you know, there's not a lot of special editing put into it, whatever. But if I did that, it would kind of take away from what I'm saying. But, um, you know, it's like, oh, you did the bare minimum to get into this space. You're super celebrated, popular, blah, blah, blah. Like, you know, I, I could do that. But then that's me, one, comparing myself. And then, like, I start to just assume that what I do would be better than them because I feel like I put more work into it. And that's not fair to me. And it's not fair to that other person for me to discredit them because I don't feel like they're doing something the way that I would do it. Uh, so, I, you know, it's just it's just a weird, weird space that I get into. And it starts to discourage me. And it's like, you know, I don't want to do this anymore. Somebody's already doing it. Or I don't want to do this anymore because someone who isn't doing it as good as I think that I would do it is doing it. 
and took off. So, you know, what's the point of putting in the effort? What's the point of doing the work? Blah, 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 blah. I say all of that long-winded stuff to say, sometimes this sucks, okay? Um, Like sometimes doing this whole life thing sucks, especially when you feel that you are a creative person or you feel like you want to do creative things. It is the most cutthroat, uh, debilitating, whatever type thing. And it has nothing to do with anybody else. Like it's all in my head. Um, you know, like there's no reason for me to discredit someone else's work to make me feel better about my work. Just like there's no reason for me to discredit my work because someone else is doing something similar to what I want to do. Um, this whole video is just me trying to tell myself that I need to accept the fact that other people are going to do things because it's life. And if other people don't do stuff and it's just me, it would be weird. And I'm not your God. So got to get out of that. And, you know, competition is healthy, blah, blah, blah. But I have to remember that all this stuff takes time. Like all of these people... You know, even the quote unquote overnight successes or celebrities, I sometimes feel sorry for them because they didn't get a chance to prepare for what they wanted to do. But then again, you know, what I deem an overnight celebrity might be somebody who spent five, seven, 12 years of their life doing and then they finally got recognition. And because I just found out about them, I feel like they came out of nowhere again me discrediting people uh so I say all that to say I'm not going to stop doing vlogmas because I feel like you know and you're you're probably like oh it's it's only day five like why would you quit right now I you know I don't even know how to fully explain it for real but it's like I get discouraged and we're only four videos in and that to me, when I'm trying to quote unquote think logically, makes no sense. But then I'm also like, oh no, this makes perfect sense. But I can't rationalize it to myself out loud. So I know it kind of doesn't make sense. But then isn't all life just not making sense? This video feels like an extreme ramble. And um, I am, you know, I'm not sorry that it sounds like an extreme random. This is a thought process. Uh, tomorrow's Vlogmas video will be not like this um you know I already have no I don't that was a lie I'm not gonna lie I we're gonna go fabric shopping and then I'm gonna go to a birthday party and then we're gonna talk you know how I record my videos and that's gonna be great this video is not that I haven't even finished one row and oh my goodness if I can't say that I want to I really want to so I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope this doesn't discourage you from watching my vlog misses and me just oh, getting out my frustrations with really nothing but also everything. It's fine. Uh, happy vlogmas, y'all. I'm excited for the rest of Christmas. I just was having a day and in an effort to be as transparent as possible without telling you everything about myself because I still deserve some form of privacy even though I've decided to put some part of my life online here is my transparency so um happy vlogmas and see you tomorrow